Mike Lansman and welcome to another video tutorial. This InDesign video tutorial deals with the new feature that is available in InDesign Creative Cloud 2014 that relates to tables. This is really a phenomenal feature. It allows us to swap rows and columns after the table has been generated. This was previously not available in other versions of InDesign and has truly made designers' lives a lot easier. Let's start off by moving a column. We all know in InDesign if the type tool is selected and we place the cursor above that column, we see the arrow. That indicates that clicking on it will select that column. We simply can place the cursor into that column and drag to rearrange. Phenomenal. What else we can do is we could select a row if we would like to change the order of this table. Type tool selected again, place the cursor where we would like to select this row to select the row and we can simply drag it up to change the order of this table. For those of you that generate tables often, I know you will find this an exceptionally useful new feature in InDesign Creative Cloud 2014. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. Bye-bye.